know why you look why like you polar opposites. Because you're like, oh, I'm going to be cute and wear a cute top. No, on. it's because I wanted to do it with my hair because I tied it up so it was messed up. to put a bun. Oh, yeah, I mean, I had that. <laughs> Anyways, welcome back to my channel, you guys. This week's video is going to be not a highly requested video because I think only one of you guys requested this. But I should have done it a while ago. It's just, you know. Things have been hectic. It is going to be a what's in my bag video featuring our Margaret Sherwood bags. And if you're wondering why there was two, because there's two of us. <laughs> yes. Like if you've seen my bag review for the Margaret Sherwood video, I had initially just picked up this one, but then the green croc came back into stock and then Lily was like, oh, that's actually a really cute bag. So I bought it because <laughs> there's two of us. And I figured we can swap, and honestly, seeing it in person, the green croc, the mock forest green croc is so gorgeous. Like, my mom was like, oh, both bags are cute, but this one is much more prettier. You guys get to have a double what's in my bag video. This bag has been one of the bags I've been using pretty much ever since I've gotten it and it is one of the most kind of complimented bags we have for some reason. It's a very simple classic streamlined bag but honestly just the subtle details like I have the mock lizard version and Lily has the mock crocodile version and they're very eye-catching like there's enough detail to kind of pop it. A little bit of a wear and tear update. I've been using this bag not the most careful to be honest and it's pretty durable. Yeah. Handle kind of good beating. Yeah. I'm pretty careful with my stuff, like I baby my stuff a lot of the time, but with this one, just because with all the COVID precautions, I've been a little careless. Yes. A little reckless. That is exactly, <laughs> I couldn't have put it in a better words. But yes, so let's just get into what is in our bags because honestly this bag looks small, but it honestly holds quite a bit. So I'm going to go first. Uh, this is what I tip carry in my bag. So once you pop it open, I have a mask, uh, which is a staple now, and half the time I forget about it because I'm just usually picking up and dropping off. Really? I have a key pouch, which does take a significant amount of space, but the reason why I had to put a key pouch is because I kept losing my keys when I was just on a key ring. I have my car keys. I have my iPhone 6. Yes, it's super old, but if you guys are curious, an iPhone 11. I don't even know what phone this is, but this is my work phone and it's significantly bigger than my iPhone 6. I'm pretty sure it's an iPhone 11. It also fits in the bag uh, without an issue. I can actually fit both phones at the same time. It just kind of bulges out a bit, uh, which I don't typically carry both phones to be honest, only if I need to have my work phone on me. I also had a pack of Kleenex, which is a must. I also have a bagu, which is one of those like foldable, reusable bags, and I know I can use any typical foldable, reusable bags, but honestly, the bagus are like key. Like, I don't know what it is with them. They fold up really compact. Yeah. They Thanks. hold a lot. Yeah. Very uh, cute design. This is the mini ones because the regular one takes up too much yeah. space in this bag, so the mini one it is. I also have hand sanitizer. Um, I have it in a Ziploc just because I'm worried it's going to explode, but honestly, this is a bit bulky. I have another more kind of like smaller size one, but this one was because I just was transferring from a bigger container um, into this one. And then last but not least, I have my card holder, which I've downsized from a wallet to a card holder because a wallet will take up pretty much 80% of this bag, uh, just because of how it is. It's just, there's a divider in the middle. So that is pretty much what is in my bag. So you can see now what is in Lily's bag. So in my bag, it's not as like intense as hers, because uh, I let her carry the essential stuff, like the house keys. <laughs> yeah. So I don't have that. And the Kleenex. Because <laughs> ever since COVID hit, she stopped carrying house keys. She makes me carry them. Yeah. Because I was like, I don't need it. So what I have in my bag I is... hate when you don't have Kleenex because when I run out of Kleenex, I'm like, do you have Kleenex? And she's like, no. no. <laughs> so I usually, if we're near like a coffee shop or something, 
I'll try to go get us some Kleenex because this one needs it. Sid, <laughs> I have the sniffles! So what I have in my bag is obviously my phone. I have the Samsung um, S6. It's an oldie but a goodie. Uh, hand cream because my hand is always dry and she always needs some hand cream. Yeah. I carry the house keys and she carries the hand cream. <laughs> Lip balm. So essential. My lips always get dry so I always need to like moisturize my lips. Um, sometimes I'll carry like a little snack because <laughs> one of us sometimes need a little pick-me-up. So it depends. Sometimes I'll have cookies or like Smarties, candy, you know, it's whatever we have at home. Then I have uh, my coin purse because <laughs> I need to hold some coins. I just throw my chain in the middle <laughs> compartment. Like literally, it's just in the middle. And then I have my card holder, which has a cat on it because it's Charlotte Olympia. So then, bagu, obviously, essential. Obviously, since, you know, they stopped giving up bags. Yeah. <laughs> and it's so annoying when they're like, do you want a bag for 10 cents? And I'm like, no, I'm already paying. Yeah. And then, gum. Because I always want to, like, have fresh breath or whatever. Or just something to chew on. And then lately, I've been carrying Purell because I realize sometimes the world's dirty. <laughs> I need to, like, cleanse my hands. And then in my middle compartment, Are I you use more in there. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'll I sometimes have my headphones or like the aux cord to plug into the car because I want to listen to my music <laughs> when she's driving. I don't want to. I don't want to listen to the radio, so I'll put my music on. But yeah, that's all I have, and then that's it. Thumb tea. Honestly, I feel like she may actually have more stuff than I do. Comment down below who you guys think carries more stuff in their bags. I just feel like her stuff is just more tiny. <laughs> Whereas my stuff is just bulkier. So this concludes our What's in Our Bag video featuring the Mar Sherwood Vintage Brick Bag, which is kind of small but kind of mighty because honestly, you guys can tell that it holds quite a bit. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I'll be glad to get back to you and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye now. Bye.